What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Madison and Christian here. Today we're very excited to get into the new movie Bullet Train with Brad Pitt. Now we've been wanting to put some more recent movies up on our channel, given that throughout 2022, we did a lot of like 80s throwback movies like the original Indiana Jones trilogy and the Michael Keaton Batman movies, which, you know, we loved all that stuff. And we're gonna continue to do more throwback movies, so don't worry about that. However, in the meantime, we kind of wanted to catch up on some more recent movies that we kind of missed out on, and there's definitely been a bunch. Um, so today we're going to start remedying that with Bullet Train. We've heard a lot of good things about this movie. We also recently watched Barbarian for our Patreon. Um, we really love that movie. If you are a fan of horror movies, you definitely have to check that one out. It is well worth the watch. Now we're also going to be watching the murder mystery movie Knives Out Glass Onion uh, sometime later this month. So be on the lookout for that. And then on February 1st, uh, we're going to be watching Black Panther Wakanda Forever, which we still haven't seen yet. And we're very excited for that. But before we get into any of those movies, we're getting into Bullet Train today. Now, I do want to mention that we've seen the trailer. However, it's been a long time. We saw it like months ago already, so I don't really remember too much. Uh, but we do know that there's a bunch of assassins. They're stuck on this bullet train together. And I think they may or may not be going after like the same target or package or something. Uh, but it definitely seems funny and action packed. And it's a super stacked cast. So we're very excited to get into it. Thank you guys for joining us. Let's do it. Let's do it. I guess that's the dad. Oh, yeah. literally pops up. Literally tells us. <laughs> the father. I bet you that snake's gonna pop up at some point. Mm-hmm. Oh, I love him. He's such a good actor. He's good in everything. <laughs> I know, everything he's in, it's gold. <gasps> what? He was pushed? I wonder why he wasn't with him. I wonder why he was on that roof. That was a cool, albeit weird way to start the movie. Oh, that's cool. Brad Pitt in a bucket hat. Oh my god, I feel like this is what he wears in his normal life. Oh, I see what you're doing. Ladybug's supposed to be lucky. Ha, ha. Oh my god. Pretty unlucky. My bad luck is I'm not even trying to kill people in someone Oh my god. I remember the suicidal bellboy climbed to the roof of his hotel, didn't take it anymore. He fell on top of his car? Oh, oh shit. Hang in there, buddy. And he didn't die. Hang in there, buddy. Oh my god. <laughs> I like the atmosphere, people are considering. Except for that guy. Oh, what did he drop? A key. Like a key. How's he going to get in the locker if he doesn't have the key? Carver. He's going to pick it. Oh, wow. <laughs> nice. Take a gun. He didn't take it? Why wouldn't he take it? I guess he's trying to turn over a new leaf. And your handler says some conflicts require a gun. And he didn't grab it. They cut away though. Maybe he. Maybe he did grab it real quick. It. Yeah. <laughs> it's Kimiko. <laughs> oh my god! She's so cute! <gasps> Lemon and tangerine. <laughs> Lemon and tangerine? <laughs> he stole those. <laughs> and last update says the owners will be in economy class. Owners, plural. Why didn't you tell me to bring that gun? I did. Because spiritual enlightenment. Oh, so he didn't bring it. Shit. No, no, no. Oh. 
shit, I think I dropped my ticket too. Oh, was that the oh, ticket with the that key? Little, that little paper, yeah. It said I pushed him? Yeah, so that's the person who pushed his son? Mm-hmm. Oh. oh! He underestimated her. He found her. She pushed that little kid? Oof. Yeah, I want everyone to see our time. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> Pull your coat together so no one else notices, Lem. I think they'll notice the charge's code names first, but if we got with fruit, we're not uh, apple or orange. <laughs> <laughs> No fucking way I'm gonna find one Oh. Wait. What? Instagram man. Yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> he found it all quick. <laughs> yeah, he sure did. Technically, we're outside contractors. I'm Tangerine. He's Lemmy. Like the fruit. <laughs> <laughs> Take Tangerine now. He's a Gordon. This blue one, Gordon, is the strongest, the most important, but he doesn't always listen to others. <laughs> what is going on right now? Yeah, you seem like a pussy. You're sweet. No, Gordon. <laughs> <laughs> he put a sticker on his fucking head. Roasted him. I get my fucking tits. 16. I'll smash my fucking head for a brick. Well, maybe that'll help your memory. Because the fuck is wrong with you, man? It was 17. God damn it. I'll <laughs> they argue over everything. <laughs> oh! Oh, shit! Oh, shit, okay. So that's what, nine? Nine. Oh, my God! Oh, <laughs> wheelbarrowed his ass out of there. Oh, he's on time today. Oh. Three assholes with swords. Fucking get it. He threw a gun at him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, double stab. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! Damn, they're badass! And the brake on the motorcycle. 16. Oh! They grabbed his head! Oh! He didn't count that one. <laughs> what did Thomas the Tank Engine say, Lemon? I swear to me. They say it's your responsibility, mate. You don't say that, right? It's <laughs> too easy. You're overthinking it. You're overthinking it. It's not a word. Yes, it is. Really? Think it Did is. you Google it? Doesn't matter. What would Barry say? <gasps> Barry would say. Oh, she saw the case. She did. Hello. Hmm. Where's the briefcase? Oh, I thought so. <laughs> the case. Go get me the fucking case. He stashed it. <laughs> His tattoo says, trust no bitch. <laughs> you have white dead son. What do you mean, this dick? Yeah, but the silly face tattoos, yeah, he sat right in. The briefcase. Yes, of course, I've got the case. You will both be bored at Kyoto's. Oh, no. <laughs> we need to find a person to the case. Maybe you're right. Maybe my luck is starting to turn. Oh, oh no. no. <laughs> What? What? Oh, the shoes. You're going to want to hear the whole story. Or you'll be very, very sorry. <laughs> you don't hear from me every 10 minutes. Or if I don't answer this phone when you call, I want you to go in there and. Damn, she was prepared. Do you honestly not know who the white death is? Yeah, I don't even bother forwarding you the 
It's a six foot fucking six geezer from Russia. Whispers that he was exiled to the Russian mafia and it was ex KGB. No one really knows the truth. Damn, he's beating their asses. Damn. The modern plague, they said. A white death. So sure enough, they were right. Oh, he turned on them. Whoa, how metal. Is he playing oh, Russian? What? Oh, he's playing Russian roulette with him? <laughs> yeah. What's the name? I guess you're the face of the earth and one thing all night. Made an empire worthy of the white death. Oh my god. They didn't show us his face though. Hmm. That motherfucker's definitely a thief on him. Yeah. I mentioned Thomas Tank was your mum, so I'm on the shoot with a fucking face. <laughs> <laughs> Oh damn! He asked for the two responsible for the Bolivia job. He asked for pro. Oh shit! Oh my god! You delivered a briefcase two days ago to one of the White Death's associates, and I saw my opportunity. Find the case and find the way. Damn, everybody's had this case at some point. Oh, look at that. We are right but on the federal. Is it back? Max so she wants to kill the White, the White Death. Death. And Lemon and Tangerine are working for White Death. And they have his son. And they're trying to get the money for her. him. Yeah. So who is Brad Pitt working for? I don't know. You still got that bitch going out there without risk of your force and security. I guess you missed that upside of Thomas, did you? No. <laughs> <laughs> what is their plan to just shoot up the place? Oh! <gasps> now y'all are really fucked. <laughs> First his wife, now his son. That's a lot of white deaths. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, who did it? Somebody's poisoning his family. I guess so. Oh no, his mom died. The wolf. Because he's alone? Oh, oh, we saw him. That's the dude that just attacked Brad Pitt. Yeah. Okay, he's rising up the ranks. I love this part. This is great. Oh, look at those guns he has. Oh. <gasps> oh! Fucked you up, bitch! Corona product <laughs> right? placement. Product placement. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, oh, get it. Something's gonna happen to her. Woo! Oh no. That's I... usually how this works. That's a nice ass wedding, Dude, damn. Dude, beautiful. <gasps> oh. Was that Brad Pitt? No way. It kind of looked like his hair. If it was him, that might explain why he just punched him out of nowhere. <gasps> oh, what the fuck? Everything was poisoned? Oh, Brad Pitt did it, I bet. Oh my god. Why did all these people have to die? <gasps> Their eyes were bleeding, kind of like the White Death Sun. Mm hmm. Oh my god, you didn't think Oh he he put on the same suit yes. to make a point. Like remember me, motherfucker? Wow, oh my god, that gave me chills. He's <laughs> so metal. Awesome. 
Dang, you don't think that if you murdered an entire family on a wedding day that you're not going to get somebody well, coming after you? This is Brad Pitt's job. I'm sure he doesn't think twice about these things, you know? He's probably done it so many times. Look, he's looking at <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he stabbed him. He has a vest on, though, or what? Oh. <gasps> the phone saved him. You lucky son of a bitch. <laughs> Thanos. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh. What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Oh! I'm surprised none of the workers have seen this. That was close. Oh, oh. shit! <laughs> oh no! Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! He said he was unlucky, but <laughs> that guy's more unlucky. Oh, we got oh, him in no. the heart. Oh! He didn't even mean to kill him, just like he told the handler. Who are you? What if it wasn't him, though, that he was after? I think... Because didn't he say somebody else was supposed to get this job, like Cooper or Carter or something like that? Yeah. <laughs> now it's weekend at Bernie's. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> of course he would know what it is. <laughs> right. <laughs> <He's> <laughs> <going> after Thomas. You are fucking Yup. It was in the wedding you infiltrated in Mexico. <gasps> it was him. You were the cocktail server. Room, I knew I'd recognize it. <laughs> now we know who the owners of the case are. Same, 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 same. What I'm talking about. We have to have a hard discussion of the caliber of people surrounding ourselves. Why are we whispering? Oh my god, he's right there. Jesus Christ. Very rude talking on the phone, I'm trying. This rude enough for you. Fucking chop that fucking hat up your fucking arsehole. <laughs> okay, he didn't recognize him though. The little train sticker by the handle. Actually, yeah, um, the man with black framed glasses had it. He went that way. Oh, she's getting them to kill each other. Come on. You think it's her? That poisoned him? Possibly, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Who the fuck are you? Really? You don't remember me. You look like every white homeless man I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> I've forgiven. I've moved on. I've learned that any potential conflict is <laughs> for growth. <laughs> peaceful outcome. I love Brad Pitt in this movie. <laughs> oh shit. For within every wall, uh, awaits a window. I went to the door real quick. Um, every day is fucking headache when you're in it. <laughs> <laughs> then you went and killed someone. What? Oh, he thinks he did it. And he thinks he knows about that guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's a misunderstanding, classic. I learned everything about people from Thomas. Everything. Really? That's how I can read people like you so well, and you are a diesel. 
I am not a diesel. You're the diesel. <laughs> he knows who he's talking about. <laughs> Be as dead as I can over there. Oh, he called him on his bluff. Oh! oh. They have to stay quiet, though. <laughs> Oh man, that gun better not go off. <laughs> He's bleeding from his mouth. <laughs> I'm afraid. Nice. Oh, dog, let's go. It has one bullet in it, though. <gasps> <laughs> Everyone's beating up the mascot. Oh, did he not cock it? Oh, okay. What? Oh, the sleep powder. Oh. Oh. No. A little Don't heavy handed. Oh, no. <laughs> what if you need the rest? Dang, he got rid of his gun now. <laughs> oh, he had a big, big ass, ass lump on his head. That's what I thought too, yeah. Wait a minute. I'm like MacGyver. Oh! Oh no, the fucking snake! He's stuck in there with it now? Are you kidding me? Oh, maybe it's the venom? They're using the venom from it? As yeah. the poison? <laughs> what? Channing Tatum? Oh my god! He's always popping up in movies like randomly. I love it. I know. Oh shit. <laughs> he uses the doll as a silencer. Oh, there it is. Alright, game's up, big boy. Where's the case? Tell me, and I promise I'll only shoot you. Whoa, whoa it, um, it, is this the sex stuff? <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna kill your son, dude. What are you doing? Maybe a pillow to the face. Maybe something clever. Like an ear bubble on the eyes of you. Yeah, you're trapped, dude. It won't. That's not the low numbers. Just a fault. Damn. So he's got to do like zero, 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 one, mm -hmm. zero, zero, two. <laughs> he hit him back. <laughs> What is this? Like, he just lit that cigarette. <laughs> he tossed it already. <laughs> it's like the two dance gangs meeting up. Well, unlike you, I'm a professional. I want to make sure it went some Yakuza trap, but clearly not. It's some fucking 80s dance off, innit? <laughs> That's what I said! <laughs> the white dead son? Yeah, he's there. Wave to your oh. <laughs> he's puppeteering him. Oh man, it's in the quiet car. Hello, be careful. Something else is going on here. Yeah? Yeah, I still think there's some things that we're looking 
the girls the diesel. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. I'm never wrong, am I? He's doing good though. <laughs> Lemon's so cool. <laughs> Wait, he took the water. Yep, sure did. Holy shit. Yeah, I think she is the one that did it. She's got a personal vendetta against them. Yeah. Who's that snake gonna bite? I don't know. He did it? Nice. Well, don't let her know. Is that C4? I don't know, yeah. I'm doing the same thing as I did to the gun in your hand. Oh. This is a pretty gun. So that's the whole reason she pushed the sun just to get him in this spot? Yeah, get somebody else. Why would you do that to a kid? Died mid heart operation? No, that was the official cover. He was poisoned. The assassin goes by the name of the Hornet. <gasps> oh, fuck. Deals the blood, making you bleed out of every orifice. If the antidote isn't administered within 30 seconds, you're done. Are you serious? Oh, shit. That's cool. That's cool. <laughs> oh, no, this is so stressful. <laughs> oh, catch yourself, catch yourself. You got it. God damn. <laughs> They're like, oh, hey. <laughs> She's just going to grab some shit real quick. And she's not phased by them at all. Oh, no, thank you. We're okay. Oh, I, I would love a bottle of water. <laughs> it's like, are you fucking kidding me right now? We were just fighting. Bro, I just remember I gave all my money to that guy to wear my hat and glasses. He's making him Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Dog, don't kill him, see? He's so funny. <laughs> sure you want to talk this out? Don't stick it in on him. <laughs> I knew it! <laughs> How is no one hearing this? He's on his train! Oh, that it, Danny. Danny. <gasps> oh. oh my god! Oh my god! He's like, you wanna talk it out now? Oh my god. I'm like holding my breath. Is he gonna kill him with chopsticks? Oh shit. Game's up, mate. For what it's worth, you seem like a right fucking arsehole, and I'm glad you're gonna fucking die with me. Oh. <laughs> I'm glad you're gonna fucking die with me. I don't even know what Lemon looks like. Wow. Oh, he's you right. Blue black twins, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? I never asked for the combination. You know what I mean? Keep it safe, that one. Yeah. So no one gets greedy. <gasps> oh! Are you kidding me, dude? How unlucky <laughs> was that? <laughs> oh, shit. Well, now they're going to be waiting for them at the next stop. They're going to freaking kill him. He's my son. Hold up. Your son? Do you know how easy it was to get him to follow me up onto that roof? Wow. She called him a bad dad. You're a terrible father, and your son is going to pay for all the mistakes that you've made. Damn. Pardon me, I don't mean to interrupt what's uh, going on here, but uh, you wouldn't happen to have seen a tiny white prick with a pair of glasses come through here, have you? 
Oh my god, he just drank it. Uncle Kamora. Yeah. Are you right? Are you okay? That's <laughs> Oh yeah. yeah he can it. tell. Oh, he, he can, can tell, tell she's, she's a lying. diesel. Most people are some suitcase, you know, because it's a train <gasps> overnight. Oh, she said briefcase. You said briefcase. I never said briefcase. Oh, we hey. got her. I found my diesel. Hey, my boy. Within that ball, it's a window. A window of opportunity. Damn it, it's a door. It's within that wall. Oh, he's going to kick him. He's going to kick him through at the last moment. <gasps> I knew it. Because he looked at his watch and he timed one minute. No. Oh, well, this crazy motherfucker is going to jump back on? Why? Did he make it? This man, he kidnapped me and he said that he's going to hold me for ransom. No, girl, you just lied about the briefcase. I'm sorry, I get captivated by white girl tears. Charge, <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> but I'm really good at reading people, and something tells me you are just not fucking right. Ooh, hoo, hoo. trust yourself. You both raise your hands, or you both point at each other. I know you're both liars, and the truth ain't in you. And then I'll fucking shoot you both. Reggie, you, you, you said you couldn't get us both. You get no answers. I did say that. I did, didn't I? <laughs> Well, if I don't answer this phone, you can't. Two. Kill what time? Three. Oh. He's going to keep his hands raised? She has to stay alive or his son will die. He's going to he's going to literally take the bullet. Well, if he was a shitty dad, at least he like Came through at the end. His son will never know. That's true. That's the same snake he saw in the hospital room, too. Mm. On TV. This motherfucker's crazy. <laughs> I was just about to say that. Yo. <laughs> then why didn't you use this thing? Yeah, he kidnapped you, and uh, gave you his gold. So. Oh no, he caught her in a lie. Man, you are fucking, you are really, good. you sure you didn't study? I mean, I'm not even afraid of your lips quivering. <laughs> You're the diesel. You're the diesel. <laughs> Got to kill ya. <laughs> you are. Oh no, he's getting sleepy. No, oh my God. Again, she got lucky. Every single time. He thinks he can fucking break through. Oh, let's go. Did he use his head at the end? Yeah. <laughs> what? Oh shit. Surprisingly accurate. Uh oh. His son's about to die though, right? He's in the bathroom bleeding out? Yeah. He only got shot once though. Look at how raging he is. This crazy son of a bitch. He's got a great walk. I know! <laughs> Channing Tatum! Really gets me. <laughs> That's the oh. Hornet? Oh. No oh, way. What? Oh, she killed him. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, she's going to get the case from him, but it's going to kill her. She has, yeah, we, we, we know. Oh, <laughs> he punched her earlier. 
You can have the case. Oh, you see my face, bitch. <gasps> Oh, she didn't inject it. Oh, she's fucked. 30 seconds before the venom does its thing. She probably has the antidote, though, no? Oh. Oh. <gasps> Do you have a backup? Do you have a backup? <laughs> Oh, that looks agonizing. Be better prepared. I'm mansplaining. I'm mansplaining. Yeah, I'm, sorry. I'm mansplaining. <laughs> you like some water? No. You want a blanket? You want a blanket? <laughs> He's being so condescending. I know. He didn't wear his vest either. Oh, he told him to wear the fucking vest. Oh, he's gonna be really upset. <laughs> Ooh, man, he's pissed off. There's dead bodies like stashed all over this train. Now he knows it doesn't matter what happens. Mm hmm. I gotta get off this train. How do you always know what I'm doing? Because I know you. I could journal. I could journal. I should journal. <laughs> His handler at least really cares about him. Right, she's cool. <gasps> oh my god, they keep showing this snake, but it hasn't bit anybody yet. It's just chilling. I will meet you at Kyoto Station. Oh, how wonderful. I can't fucking wait. I want to look into your eyes when I kill you and your brother. He's already dead. My brother. Oh. I thought they were just like partners who became friends, but they are literally brothers. They were really brothers. That's true. I haven't seen anybody in a minute. Oh shit! Yeah, I'll never forget a face, mate. I'm so happy to see you. Please call me. Oh, there's this man and he was holding me. Is he gonna trust her? But this man, he just said that I could be a good boyfriend, a pretty girl, makes a good hostage. Yeah, well, we ain't wrong there, but hey, look, keep your fucking neckies on. Right. Oh no, he's buying it. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's all right. Fine. I'll take your bet on it, apparently, anyway. <gasps> he put the diesel sticker on her! He was right. There's been a diesel running up and down his train, causing all sorts of fucking havoc. Yes! <laughs> no! No! You shot him, Brad Pitt! What the fuck? Oh, fuck! What? Oh, no! Holy shit! Brad Pitt, are you a fucking moron or what? We make the next stop. We'll be fine. God damn it. Everything Lemon did was for nothing. Damn, this is an ominous train station. Leave it. Let's go. Let's go. We gotta go. Right now, young lady. <laughs> right now, young lady. 
No, 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 no. God. Okay, it. well, you deserve to die if you're gonna fall for this shit. Who's left? I think that's the grandfather. Oh, he got on the train. I see. I took this. I didn't want to leave it. The mum had it, and I thought you could probably use it to kill whoever. Oh, but he doesn't use guns. <gasps> he heard her voice. He knows. Yes! I knew he would know. He's dead. There's no antidote. No more antidote. <laughs> Wrong button. <laughs> so he's dead. Just a few miles back. They are both dead. Oh, because he didn't answer the phone just now. Mm-hmm. What makes you think? Oh, thank God. Fucking clutch. Oh, yes! Oh! Let's go! She was watching him! She was. Fuck yeah! Hey! Let's go! Oh, shit. The only thing you know about an old man, young lady, is that he has survived much more and much worse than you. For sure. Snake, don't open. <laughs> In English. <laughs> right. On a Japanese train. You're not going to believe this coincidence, but I already got a dose of antivenom in me today, so... Oh, that's true. So I guess it won't affect him? I'm going to tell you a story now. No, I'm good. It's short. Really, I'm fine. No. It's very quick. No, no. Just listen to the story. <laughs> Oh, Whoa. shit. Oh, he was there. Last thing he did was look at him. Mm-hmm. Is that his wife? No. Where's his son? I know. Almost. Oh, I guess she hit him. Oh! Look at him! Ten torch. As a boy, I was told there is a spot on his back for each of the seven souls of the world. It holds all the bad luck so that others may live in peace. Oh! Wow! He's like, I don't want that. Seems like a decent guy. Aww. You shot me. <laughs> me too. Me too. <laughs> <gasps> wow. What? The sleeping beds. He was just sleeping? <laughs> Am I in hell? He's gonna see the necklace. Oh no. <gasps> he did wear it! Oh. oh, you drank the water. Oh, oh no. Where the fuck is my brother? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> so he was wearing the vest and he wasn't. Well, he got shot in the neck. Oh, yeah. he said that. You could get shot in the yeah, neck. Yeah, he was like, even if you wear the vest, you can fuck around and get shot in the neck. There was a ton of foreshadowing at the beginning. Now I'm noticing. You're more like Thomas anyway, huh? Oh, no. 
Oh man. Why are they doing this to me? Kira Knightley. <laughs> doing toilet paper. Point a finger at someone in blame. There are four fingers pointing back at you. <laughs> He's got his thumb straight up. <laughs> you shot my fucking brother. You shot my son. We prepare together, or we die alone. Yeah, they have to work together. Uh oh, he's tying his hair up. Oh, there it is. Gonna buy some time. He said, "I'm gonna." Does Does he know that there's a bomb inside? No, and the only person that knows that is the son, and I don't know why he hasn't said anything. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Wait, what? It's Michael Shannon? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, what? So she killed her own brother? Oh, no, it wasn't no. her, right? Yeah, it was, it was the, Hornet. the Hornet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, but she spit on him. That's why she did that. Oh, so he gave attention to the son, not her. He sees the contraption in it. I think he thinks it's just a decoration. Fucking do it! <laughs> the fuck is wrong with him? Wow, he didn't even care about killing her. Yeah. That must have felt really bad for her. Uh oh. They took it away from him. It's gonna explode. Why is it always gotta be us that opens the shit? Just open a goddamn case. Nope. Well, you're not about. You're about to die. It's so safe. Why didn't he just open it? What if it's a bomb and it blows up in our faces? <laughs> Some stupid mask gonna protect us. Yeah, he's right. Oh. Uh, no, 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 no. Nothing in life is an accident. It was an assassination attempt on me. Oh. When I'm a job in Bolivia, butchering my entire crew. Oh, so he set them up. Of her rib, piercing her heart. Oh, only the most skilled cardiovascular surgeon. <gasps> and the hornet killed him. That was the doctor. It's earlier, the surgeon was poisoned. Wow. Damn, so everybody has something to do with it on the train. I don't want to sound judgmental, but if you hired the Hornet, you had your own kid killed? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I decided a piece of shit. Oh. oh, he set that up. But she promised it was the last time we would ever bail him out of trouble. So he blamed his son, too. But now there is only one left. Mr. Carver. Oh, Carver! He's not. He's not Carver. He's not Carver. Oh, shit! I knew that was gonna come back up. No! <laughs> are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> that motherfucker! He didn't take the job on purpose. Oh! He got pushed back on the train. Let's go! Oh! 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 He did a hat trick! Oh, the sword was in the cane. Of I knew course, it. Of I course. I told you. <laughs> oh! He shot his own guy. Nice. Let's go! 
Oh my god. <laughs> Hey, these oh, dudes are fun. On top? Yeah, they're dead. Hey! What? Hey, it's, <laughs> it's, uh, it's a Japanese cover. <laughs> Ooh! I need a hero. Yes! <gasps> oh! Yo, this bumps. <laughs> yes! Woo! Nice. Dude, he's so badass. Let's go. Damn. Nice. Damn. Oh, he was Scorpion in uh, Mortal Kombat movie, wasn't he? He sure was. Oh, they're gonna fucking 1v1! Cockroach, I do not know why you're here, but move out of my way, or you will join your wife! Oh, he's like, you're about to join yours. Oh, you stopped the train. Uh, fuck that. I took the velocity of the train and divided it by the mass, and I realized that I don't know how to fucking drop a bullet train. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I cannot believe it's him. Still blowing my mind. Aww. Oh. It's some motivation. They were cutting a little bonsai together. I got this. Stop the train. What? Oh no. <gasps> oh. Okay. <laughs> Drop kicked him. Damn, that katana cut through the TV? Hey, oh! <laughs> that was insane. Oh this no. This movie is too much. Oh no, oh no, oh no. No, 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 no. Oh! Holy shit! Those dudes lived? Yo, they should be called Ladybug. I can't believe Brad Pitt lived. He was at the front. <laughs> Say sorry two times. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to beat the fire out. Nice. Oh, oh, smart. Damn, he is lucky. <laughs> He's like lucky. Unlucky. <laughs> it like balances itself yeah. out. Oh. Nice. He was about to kill him. I got another brother now. Really? Fuck no. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Why didn't he just kick him? Do you think he lived? Maybe, but I don't know. That was a that was a far fall. <gasps> oh, he's gonna it's hit gonna the brakes. Go, it's gonna send him flying. Fuck it. Nice. He saved him. Oh! Oh <laughs> shit! Look! Uh oh. The water bottle. The water bottle. <laughs> We're gonna follow its journey. <laughs> All the shit it's been through. <laughs> oh my god! Poor water bottle. Oh, nice! That was clutch! That was fate! Oh. The water bottle! The water bottle! The water bottle! Yes! I like that he redeemed himself! Oh shit, oh shit! Oh my god! What?! <laughs>
<laughs> How is he so lucky? <laughs> They're watching him fly past. Oh! It's soft! Yes! <laughs> Damn, all the bad luck surrounds him so that everyone can live in peace. I guess so, yeah. It all makes sense. Not the oh, snake. Oh, no, no. Oh, fuck. He, he lived? The driver, I want the driver. I hired the driver. Yeah, no, he had a stomach thing, man. <laughs> He had a stomach thing. He might have known this was gonna happen and didn't take the job, you know? Hmm. For what it's worth, Carver is a dick. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I get it. Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> oh, he has no bullets. He had one in the chamber. And he accidentally shot it when he yeah. got thrust. Oh no! Just go, He's gonna hit it! <laughs> it's gonna kill him. Where's the daughter actually? Oh She did it. She killed him. She did it. Yeah Damn it blew half of his head off. Damn. She was like I want it to be thorough. Yeah. Oh my god It's my luck that delivered my father's corpse at my feet <laughs> Okay The narcissism, the narcissism. <laughs> Oh! Tangerines! Oh! Tangerines! Carmen? Well, well. Dental machine. Tangerine. It was! <laughs> Back from the grave, Tangerine saved him! Is this his handler? Is this Sandra Bullock? Sandra fucking Bullock is his handler? <laughs> hey, next time take the gun. Don't listen to Barry. Don't listen to Barry. <laughs> yeah, a lot, a lot of this could have been avoided if he took the gun. Of course. Yes, it is. Try not to pull it Oh. <laughs> I think that's bad luck. But good luck that they weren't in it when it happened. Really? See what I'm doing? I do. Turning that upside down. I do. <laughs> this is working. They could have crashed on the way. This is working. <laughs> this is working. Walk faster. Okay. He's gonna get away. <laughs> oh damn. Dude, that was a crazy movie. It got so wild at the end. Dude, yeah, definitely wild. I I can't even believe some of the turns the story took, but I love that all the little breadcrumbs in the beginning kind of all, all led to the end, yeah. you know? Oh, oh, 10 minutes earlier. Oh, he <gasps> lived. Lemon, lemon. Uh-oh, so is that guy. So is that guy. <laughs> Does it work? Hell yeah. <laughs> He drove it! Yes! <laughs> fucking A right! Take a bow, bitch. Let's go. That was perfect. That was the best payoff I've ever seen in a movie ever. <laughs> Well, guys, I gotta say, we thoroughly enjoyed this movie. I feel like it was a great popcorn flick. It kind of had a little bit of everything. Um, the jokes were really hitting for us, obviously. I feel yeah. like we were laughing throughout the entire movie. Uh, it was very high octane. All the action was very visceral. There was a ton of crazy kills throughout the movie. It was very visceral, uh -huh. yeah. I loved all of the callbacks and the foreshadowing throughout the movie. All the the bad luck this, good luck this parts of the movie were amazing. And then of course all of the cameos, especially the ones that we, we didn't know were coming, like the Ryan Reynolds one and the Channing Tatum one. I just feel like every five, 10 minutes, something crazy was happening in this movie. And you know, at the end of the day, all we needed this movie to be was fun. 
and it definitely, definitely delivered on the fun for sure. Yeah, I will say the Channing Tatum uh, cameo was hilarious to me. Um, but I think the uh, relationship that I most enjoyed in this movie was between Tangerine and Lemon. I thought their chemistry on screen was great. I, every conversation with them was hilarious. Mm -hmm. And not to mention every single thing in their conversations, actually everybody in this movie, all like you said earlier, all of the little Easter eggs in their conversations were all paid off at the end, you know? And it's crazy because I wasn't expecting to cry in this movie. Um, but you know, the whole thing with Tangerine and Lemon, I felt like their performances were really, really well done to the point where, yeah, it, it brought me to tears. He did a great job. Yeah, you didn't even cry when he got shot and died. You cried when the other dude was crying about it. Yeah, when <laughs> yeah. Tangerine was having that moment with him, yeah, that's where it got me. And another thing that I will say, you know, um, I remember seeing the trailer for this, you know, a while back and I knew the whole movie was basically going to be on this train. So I was like, oh no, that might get a little boring. It might get a little stagnant. No, they, I really enjoyed how they did this. Like I felt every train car was completely different. You know, we had the neon kawaii one. We had the quiet one. We had the bar car, the snack car. Like mm -hmm. I felt like you could make a map of everywhere on this train throughout the movie and like kind of know and pinpoint where everybody is and like who's gonna go, go past each other you know and because there's so many characters in the movie and they're all on the phone they're all switching cars it kind of helped us as the viewer pay attention and know what's going on the fact that the entire movie happened on one train you know? yeah and it's crazy too because even the stations we would end up at were all individual in their own and they all looked they were all designed so different. They all, all had their own just personality. vibe. Yeah, their own personality to them, you know? Like even the last one that we ended up at was super ominous. So I really enjoyed that. You know, a movie that's taking place on like one area the whole time, I enjoy that they added a little creativity to the rest of it and like all the stops. Now I do want to bring up the star of the show here, uh, Brad Pitt as Ladybug. Um, when I first saw the trailer and I knew it was like a bunch of assassins on a train, I got a little worried that it was Brad Pitt because he doesn't, he just doesn't scream action hero to you. But in retrospect, I actually think it was genius that they got him because he's such a charismatic, chill, laid back guy. And, and he ended up being like the pacifist in yeah, the, the movie. Yeah, the one who wouldn't use the a one, gun. Yeah, the, the one, one assassin. Yeah, exactly. So in retrospect, I feel like it's actually perfect. Had they gotten a tough guy, it wouldn't have made as much sense, you know? So yeah. I do think that probably this wasn't Brad Pitt's like best performance ever, but for this type of movie, I feel like he definitely knocked it out of the park for sure. Yeah, I feel like you're right. Like he was the perfect cast for this. Like mm -hmm. who else could you imagine being the one assassin that doesn't carry a gun? He he nailed it on the head and I'm really glad they, they used him. Now, obviously there was a ton of cameos in this movie. That's one of the things that I, I love about it is just, they would get people to show up out of nowhere. And it was like very famous people too. They weren't just getting like C-list actors, you know? Yeah, and then um, they're only getting them for like three seconds of yeah, the movie. Yeah, yeah that's so. how they're paying them all, right? It's pretty cool. Um, I did enjoy seeing Sandra Bullock at the end, even though she didn't really have that big of a part at the end. She kind of just showed up and had a couple lines. Yeah. Um, the Channing Tatum one was hilarious though. Yeah. Channing Tatum, of course, showing up in a random movie. He's so good at that. Yeah, with a random funny <laughs> scene like he always is just great at those but my favorite one I think was the Ryan Reynolds uh cameo where he was Carver that, yeah that's what his name was right Carver. Carver I thought that was so funny because um I don't know if you guys have seen Deadpool 2 I guess if you haven't spoiler alert spoiler alert uh but there's a scene in Deadpool 2 where they recruit like an invisible guy to Deadpool's team and they jump out of a plane with parachutes and the invisible guy uh, ends up running into like the power lines and we see him turning visible and it's Brad Pitt. For just a second. For just like, like five seconds in the movie mm -hmm. and it's like you the audience are like so taken aback like what the fuck was that Brad Pitt? <laughs> Where did that come from? So I thought it was genius that in this movie they reversed that and it's yeah. Brad Pitt's movie but Ryan Reynolds showed up for like a five second cameo that was just out of nowhere and equally hilarious as happened in Deadpool 2, you know? So I definitely, definitely love that cameo. 
All right, guys, well, we really loved this movie. And honestly, I think we're gonna have to go watch like a breakdown video or something so we can catch all the little Easter eggs and like things we missed. And like we mentioned earlier, we are gonna be watching Glass Onion very soon. So keep your eyes peeled for that. But if y'all enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like and subscribe because it definitely helps us out. Follow our Instagram for some extra content from us. And real quick, we did wanna make a shout out to our newest Patreon supporters, Hubert, Pim, Scott, and James. You guys are the greatest along with all of our other supporters. Now, before we go, we did wanna mention that our bonus movie reaction is up on our Patreon. It was barbarian. We had so much fun watching the movie. It definitely scared the hell out of us. And it will be exclusively on our Patreon for the rest of this month. So if you'd like to support the channel, get an extra movie reaction, action and vote on our next movie we'll leave a link for our patreon down below but as always you guys are the greatest and we'll catch you in the next one peace out guys bye